Betelgeuse is a member of the Orion constellation, a star that one can see with the naked eye when observing the night sky, approximately 700 light years away. However, if it were to burst as a supernova and be 30 light years away from Earth, it would cause all life to end. For this reason, the world's astronomers have been forced to look around the sky for whispers, promising not to miss this once-in-a-lifetime event. Still, while observing this red giant, they also discovered something mysterious. This report will describe what the Webb telescope saw. The red giant has an average temperature of 3,600 degrees Kelvin and is 600 light years away from Earth. According to the documentary, the giant is 600 times more massive than the Sun. In general, stars exceeding 100 times the Sun in size can be considered giant stars. Thus, according to these feats, even the location of the Sun would have the insides of Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, and Jupiter if Betelgeuse were in its place. Betelgeuse is roughly 60,000 times brighter than the Sun. When you look up in the sky, you can see the star without the need for a telescope. As one scientist put it, Betelgeuse's surface is, quite frankly, mesmerizing, causing you to believe it is spinning rapidly. This type of stellar spin rate is determined by meticulously evaluating the differences in the light emitted by a star's diverse parts. The light emitted by the section of the star that is shifting toward us as it moves toward the side, we are gazing, shifts toward the blue side of the light spectrum, while the light from the portion that is moving away from us is shifted toward the red side. Why astronomers think Betelgeuse will explode, Betelgeuse is already on the doomed to explode list in the priority category. It is not a question of whether it will explode, but when, perhaps you may enjoy an 8-10 million year life for a star. The Sun is 4.5 billion years old. However, Betelgeuse is on the verge of extinction at an incredible rate. Betelgeuse is a red giant star that is dying and is close to collapse. You must have thought Betelgeuse became red and faint. After UY Scuti, the largest star in the galaxy, the Sun is aging and will shed its outer layers into space, shrinking into a white dwarf aging stars leave the main sequence and become red giants. Stars are so distant that no matter how good your telescope is, you can always detect only one point of light. Therefore, feel free to install the Hubble telescope in your backyard, and the star will remain just a point of light. Betelgeuse is very close to us in cosmic terms so its surface can be detected because it is a giant star, even though it is not smooth. Through a process called interferometry, astronomers combined images from several telescopes to obtain this image of the star's surface. The dark areas on the star's surface are formed by sunspots, familiar with our sun. The size is enormous here. Betelgeuse is a red giant close to its end, and the distance between it and the sun is almost 800 million kilometers from Jupiter. The size of the Sun is only 1.4 million kilometers. Will there be a supernova anytime soon? Astronomers at Villanova University have finally found that Betelgeuse is fading. Indeed, in December, Betelgeuse was the faintest star over the past 50 years, which has already led to the assumption that Betelgeuse is very allegedly going to explode. Scientists have even theorized whether a so sharp decline in brightness indicates that the star has. No time left. Astronomer Serafina Nance explained that giant stars suffered a great loss when they came up to the end of their time. The loss of brightness means, naturally, there are always astronomers who think differently, such as astrophysicist Emily Brunson of the University of York, who explained to the BBC that Betelgeuse's brightness is not constant when observed from Earth. She later added, There's no information that Betelgeuse might explode at any moment. It's just that we've never had the opportunity so far to see the last systemic process leading to the explosion of a supernova. Therefore, 
such an outcome was always possible. Another astronomer, Daryl Seligman, an astrophysicist at Yale University, noted to Euronews, it's a very big star, about 20 solar masses. These giant stars are burning their elements much faster than normal stars. That is why they live much less time. Seligman added that in case of a possible supernova explosion, a spectacular light show in the sky should be expected. According to scientists who observed Betelgeuse in recent months indeed, there are signs that a star is about to explode. Nevertheless, at the same time, not a single scientist can confidently say anything about the lump sum one can expect the collapse will occur. As a side note, Seligman mentioned that even the moment of the explosion is not very clear. That is, it is impossible to exclude the fact that the color of Betelgeuse has changed due to the same chemical processes on the star's surface. However, he added, you should not reject the possibility that light from the star is obscured by dust if such a mass loss occurred. Supernovae can do extremely much harm, so it is argued that if the sun explodes, then the solar system body might disappear completely. In addition, there is a hypothesis that the explosion of stars is the reason for the Earth's warming. On the other hand, they can destroy the ozone layer. In addition, our planet remains exposed to destructive solar and cosmic radiation. The best part is that few people will explode like Betelgeuse, primarily because it is still much smaller. However, at the same time, some scientists predict that Swell and the Sun will probably swallow Mercury, Venus and Earth in just a few billion years. Finally, the Penosnius news. From a scientific point of view, Betelgeuse is at a safe distance from the Earth. An astronomer, Emily Brunson, believes that Betelgeuse would serve us with the opportunity to watch the life of a dead star and get more insight into the universe. If it explodes now, it would be quite an employer's recognition for the astronomers as we would have to revise most of the things we know about other stars. Still, it would also be a very spectacular one. Even though the death of stars had already been explored and described from many perspectives in different epochs of humankind, there was never once the opportunity to see the very transformation of a star system. 700 light years is far away for Betelgeuse, but for astronomy, it is generally a nearby star of the Milky Way. This is the only star after the Sun whose surface can be explored in detail. The scientists who observed Betelgeuse in recent months say that all the signals are clear. The star is on the verge of explosion, the imminent collapse. However, it is difficult to say something definite about when it will happen. Follow our path through this astounding narrative. Please like, share and subscribe. Share your thoughts, comments and inquiries down below and keep your head to the sky.